Hello YouTube, TJ DC Life here, and today I have a very exciting knife to unbox for you. And this knife is a big knife. And yeah, without further ado, let's jump right into it. I'm using my Oz Machine Company as well, Silver Surfer to unbox this knife. And this knife is from Oz Machine Company. It's not the rosy, but this one is the extra large one. Let's first cut this open. Okay. Oh, interesting. This extra large one doesn't have a box so it's just uh, some wraps and let's cut this open cool looks like we got the knife and some paperwork Okay, it looks like the COA is in this plastic bag. This aside. Cool. You can see Rosewell extra large number is um, 47. And date of birth is March 27th. 2024 and same 63 to 64 HRC Magnica blade angled mailing OTI construction and the maker signature here and another cool sticker from Oz Machine Company and the knife is in this bag nice pouch we got a oz machine company pouch let's see the knife okay set the pouch aside here is the extra large rosewell super super cool the angled milling on this knife is gorgeous and there are some mailing on the club as well and it's really a big knife number is 0047 cool let's give it a flick wow the D10 is even better on this extra large one the closing is smooth as well so cool feels super solid yeah same construction same kind of um, blade and uh, handle ratio it's just bigger see wow such a big knife action is perfect super good detent super smooth closing action All TI construction, stone washed configuration. Yeah, let's uh, do a quick size comparison between this extra large one and my regular one, the Silver Surfer one. As you can see, when close, the size is quite different. 
I would say around like 30% bigger. And when open, you can see the blade is, I would say like quarter, quarter inch longer than the regular and the handle is almost yeah a quarter inch longer as well let's do some big knife comparison bring out the pm2 it's longer than the pm2 okay the handle is almost the same in length but the blade is is less longer than B, than the PM2. How about uh, compare it to the Chris Reeve Woman Zone? It's bigger than the Woman Zone, just a little bit bigger, but uh, it's bigger. Handle is almost the same. Blade is a touch, a touch longer than the woman zone. So they, these two are quite similar in size. Okay. How about compare it to a para three? As you can see, is way larger than the para three. How about me grab another one compare it to my Demco AD20. It's quite similar with the AD20. As you can see, almost the same in length. Definitely not a medium knife, I would consider this a big knife, extra large indeed. Okay, let's do a quick weight test on this Rosewell XL. See how much this weights. 5.238 ounce. And compare it to the regular rosy, which is 2.977. So it's quite heavier than the regular, but it's not like a super heavy knife. It's under six ounces. Wonder, let's see. Um, the length, uh, let's see the thickness, almost the same thickness as the regular, I would say just a touch thicker than the regular. Yeah, super cool. Really like the angled mailing, which gives more grip to the knife. Ergos are amazing. You can choke up. If you have like a large hand, this would fit really well. I have a, a small hand, uh, so it's kind of a little bit bigger in my hands. But uh, if you have large hands, this would fit right in. Yeah, super good action out of the box. And the clip has really good retention as well. Cool. 
take a closer look at the mailing and the machine work on this knife it's just amazing and let's check the centering of the blade as you can see the blade is dead center I would say yeah super nice okay that's it this is my first impression and unboxing of this Oz Machine Company Roseball XL super cool knife and let me know what you think about this uh, new version that they put out do you like this one better or do you like the regular one better let me know in the comment section and i hope you enjoy this uh, video and hope to see you in my next video